Nice of you to finally join us. Those damn Montclairs have locked me out of my own city. You know how to get things done. Join up with Scordo and help him find a way into the city. I'll keep the troops on alert and ready to move on your signal. I sent Scordo and a small group to establish a secure base among the farmhouses outside the city. Countess Tamrith went with him. Against my better judgment, I might add. And that North Point is an important trading center. With many... You walked into the wrong farmhouse, Montclair! Well, kiss a troll and call me Pumpkin. I know you from Shornhelm. Did Baron Dorel send you? It's a disguise. What's wrong? Don't you like it? Is my helmet on crooked or something? No idea. He went to scout around and hasn't come back yet. So I suggested busting a hole in the wall, but the Countess decided we'd just save that as a last resort. Dare Do your worst, lackey to a foreign crown. Well, I guess that would be all right. I am a guard of the First Order, a member of the Blood Talon Cloaks of House Montclair. More than that, you won't get out of me. Why could that possibly matter? Really? Your beloved Countess would never stand for that. You're bluffing. You're the one? You killed Rizal Jewel? I'm just a guard. In the off. I was wondering when you were gonna show up. Reconnaissance, but keep your voice down. No need to wake the good captain. And know what I learned? There's not a single guard in North Point. Not a one. Isn't that enough? I was fairly proud of that bit of espionage. But you're right, there's more. The good captain here let slip that there's a smuggler's tunnel. Lead my, my, Sidarian. That was impressive. But when it comes to smugglers' tunnels, I think there's a thing or two I can teach you. I'm not I must sure say, I'm Darian that. certainly has a way with the ladies. That's not how I'd go about extracting information from the enemy. 
but I can't fault his results. Well, the smugglers who use the tunnels installed a gate. Gives them a monopoly on the black market in North Point. The smuggler boss is a tough pirate. Go We're not even allowed in the city. If you have a talk to Captain Kala. I saw her giving that new transfer a piece of her mind. I saw that. She dragged the poor guy into the officer's quarters. I haven't seen either of them since.
What do you think you're doing on my ship? Do you know what I did to the last stowaway I found? Well, the last time I looked, my hold didn't lead into the city. Wait a well, you're a tough one, aren't you? All right, we'll do it your way. I was coming back to get my key. I need to get into North Point myself, rescue my gang. At the moment, all I care about is the safety of my gang. They were in. The tunnel is inside the cove beneath the lighthouse. That key will unlock the trap door. Over here, by the rocks. Come on, I'll take you to where the others are waiting. Tell us you found something, hero. We could use some good news. I'm not interested in news. Tell me you found something no, good, hero. It's not like the fate the of Riven Spires hanging in the balance or anything. Right then, let's go see what Lorea's doing in there. North Point. It just feels empty. His Lordship, the Baron over there, wants us to head inside, see what's going on, and secure the area. I need to let Verandas know what's going on. In the meantime, talk to Scaldo. He knows the city like the back of his hand. So it's just us mortals from here on in? It's fine with me. I don't. North Point was my home for the last few years, so I know the place pretty well. Never snuck in through a smuggler's tunnel, though. That's gonna be a new experience. We need to sneak in slowly, one at a time. Wandering around as a group would just be inviting trouble. Hold on! I'm coming with you! Let's check the buildings. There has to be one we can use as a safe location. Inkeep Bollock lived here. I hope he isn't one of these blood fiends. Anyway, this place is too small for our needs. Let's keep looking.
This should do nicely. Let's make sure it's clear. Go on. Go find the rest of our assault team. I'll have because you're gonna go back out there and let them know where we are. Watch your arse out there. I mean, did you... Foul creatures! Well, that's never happened before! Look out! Behind you! when I heard the innkeeper scream. But I was too late. He gave me the key to the inn before he died. I think he tried to tell me something, but I couldn't make it out. Be on your guard. Here comes more of those monsters. Just so you know, this isn't a usual occurrence. Oh, who am I kidding? This happens to me all the time. Can I assume the house you emerged from is our safe location? Of course it is. I'll just wander over and have a little lie down. It's all the same with you. Letting a noblewoman wander alone through a city full of vampires and blood fiends. Arcade guides our way as usual. 
May the light watch over them. Praise R.K. Gather the others and let's meet at the manor. We have plans to make and I fear our time grows short. The light preserve us. There you are. Have you found anything yet? I thought my son might be hiding here, in his office. Alec and I haven't always seen eye to eye, and he's made no effort to hide his feelings about me and his journal. He does mention the arrival of Lady Lorea, though. Serene Manor. I know it well. Nice to see we finally found a good use for that pompous ass. Try not to let the blood fiends suffer when you kill them. They were the citizens of North. Infatuated with the woman. Didn't even get along when she started turning people into blood fiends. More blood fiends? I hate this. Just give me something to hit already. But it does sound like your son betrayed North Point, Baron. It's the remnant. It put Alec under her spell. I'm surprised he was even able to write in his journal. Maybe that was his way of warning us. Baron was just filling us in on what was written in his son's journal. Spell or no, Elec has a lot to answer for. First, we need to find out if anyone survived Lorea's private party. The Count Zodarian accomplished something useful after all. Go upstairs and get that key. Funny thing, Darian was scratched and battered, claimed the blood fiends bit him. Part of me wants to find Lorea in there, then we could put a blade through her and be done with this business. Darian can't talk right now. I gave him something to relieve his pain, and to quiet him down for a little while. The end of my staff. Right to the side of his head. Best A key? Yes. RK provides. Bless us all. Head to the inn. I'm right behind you. Whoever or whatever you may be, I advise you to go away and leave us alone. I believe we are perfectly safe up here. Thank you all the same. Now go away. That's just what I'd expect one of Lorea's minions to say. 
Now leave us alone. You, in the attic. I am Allard, Baron of House Dorel. And I swear you will be safe in my hands. It's good to see you're still alive, my old friend. And you as well. But tell me, is Elec hiding up there? I'm sorry to say, but no. I left him. It's good to see Baron Allard again. He's like a brother to me. When Larea sealed the city and began turning people into blood fiends, I used my sword to cut a path to this inn and led as many as I could to safety. Quite a few, and there are more hiding around the city. But it started innocently enough. She had Lord Elec call a gathering at the square. A spell, perhaps? I'm not really sure. Lady Larea has taken Dorel Manor as her own. But I... What? All the nobles have gathered. What an excellent party. Someone new. How exciting. Come on. Oh, I know you. You must be the one her beautiful ladyship has been expecting. You're just in time for our grand celebration. We're celebrating the new and better life that will soon be ours. Probably. But it's not what you think. We freely accepted the will of the beautiful Lady Larea. My lady is upstairs. I'm sure she'd love to meet you. And you. Friends, fellow nobles, the glorious blessing of Lady Lorea is you almost might as upon well us. come up. I know that you're here. I can take your presence. pain away. I can make you feel s well, well, well. You're not at all. Let me take a look at you. Hmm. So you're the one who dispatched my father's pet Argonian. Well done, by the way. Well done. Isn't it fascinating? You want to strike me, but your weapon hangs loosely at your side. I wonder why that is. Oh, I know. It's because I will it. You believe the nobles are in danger? You want to save them? <laughs> How sweet. You're trying to resist me? Oh, <laughs> what sport we shall have. You need to resist her, my friend. I ask only one small, insignificant thing from you. One tiny favor. You must all give yourselves totally. You must break free of her spell before all is lost. Just as in Locrata, Maria has cast a bet. Illusion. But just as at Lucrata, you can manipulate its power using its hair. You have. As usual, Verandas once again ruins my fun. I guess I'll just have to destroy you now. You hate me, don't you? Why does everyone hate me?
wanted it to come to this. I had hoped to save Lorea from this fate. Or else, I should have been the one to end her campaign. Lorea gathered the nobles here, played with them, forced them to love her. It was the closest she could get to real happiness since the loss of her mother. Your perceptions are excellent. She used this veil in two ways. To hide herself and to overwhelm your senses with illusion. With Lorea's death, the power of the veil fades. As soon as it dissipates, the nobles will appear. What? What? By the Eight, who did this? Lorea Montclair? Yes, she arrived here. She said she was here to help. Then, I can't remember anything else. I... I need to get outside. Of course. The people, listen to me. Let's head outside and make sure the rest of the city is secure. In the name of High King Emric, and in accordance with the laws of the land, I hereby order the arrest of Alec Dorel for treason and the death of his kinsmen. But father, it wasn't my fault. You allowed an enemy into our city, into our home. Dozens fell to these monsters because you couldn't ignore a pretty face. I never meant for anyone to get hurt. I'm not even sure what happened. Lorea said she wanted to help, and... I'm sorry. Apologies won't bring our people back. And it won't return honor to our family name. Guards! Take Alec away. You are dead to me, Alec. Dead to me. I'm sorry I disappointed you, Father. It won't happen again. You may not believe this, but that wasn't how I wanted our reunion to play out. I left Alec in charge. The safety of North Point was his responsibility. Someone has to answer for the deaths he caused this day. I appreciate the support. I also thank you for making that witch Lorea pay for her crimes. Shrouded Pass? That means Montclair is in the Doom Crack. Then the time has come to strike down the traitor and restore peace to our shores. But first I want to thank you for helping the people of North Point. It has been a grueling day. Then the time has come to meet Count Ravenwatch at the base of the Doomcrag. <laughs>